In this video instruction, I will learn you how to make a beautiful white lace tape made in crochet lace technique. This is double-sided lace tape. You can use it as a bracelet, belt, or other accessories. Or you can use it in Irish lace project. This is the second variation of this cord. While crocheting this lace tape, I show you how to make two or three kinds of such lace tape. I did double crochet stitches instead of puff stitches. This cord made of variegated yarn. Let's begin the work. For work you need a ball of yarn and a crochet hook. Begin the work by making a chain. Then chain of five more. One, two, three, four, five. Then yarn over the hook eight times. Yarn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I hold all loops with my finger. I insert the hook into the first chain stitch, pull up a loop, and pull through two loops. Eight times one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have two loops on the hook and make yarn over, pull through. In total it should be nine times. Then chain, work with this stitch. Make single crochet. Let's count one, two, three. On the top of this single crochet, I am making three chain pico. One, two, three chains for the pico, and a slip stitch into two loops of the single crochet. The pico is ready. Continue working with single crochet. Make 14 single crochet around this stitch. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. Turns the work. Make a chain of five, one, two, three, four, five. Yarn over the hook. We skip one, two, and work with the third one. Insert the hook into the third stitch. Pull up a loop. 
to the level of the double crochet. In total it should be three. First is made, we need to do two more. Two, three, then yarn over the hook, pull through all loops on the hook except the last one. We have two loops on the hook, then yarn over, pull through. The puff stitch is ready. Then chain of three for the pico and the slip stitch into two loops of the puff stitch. Chain of two. We skip next stitch and work with puff stitch into the second stitch. Yarn over, pull up a loop, one, two, three, then yarn over, pull through except the last one and pull through two loops. Chain three for the pico and the slip stitch into two loops of the puff stitch. Chain of two, we skip the next stitch and continue with the next puff stitch into the second stitch of the previous row. In total it should be five of them. I did five puff stitches. I remind you I did two chains between two puff stitches. Then I'm going to make Subtuple treble crochet stitch. I will work with this chain stitch. Now yarn over the hook eight times. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I hold all loops with my finger, insert the hook into the, this chain stitch, pull up a loop, pull through two loops nine times. Let's repeat again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Make a chain. Three single crochet, one, two, three, chain three for the pico and slip stitch into the loops of the single crochet and fourteen single crochet stitches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, Thirteen and fourteen. Turn the work, make a chain of five, one, two, three, four, five, yarn over the hook, we skip two stitches and 
make puff stitch into the third into the third stitch yarn over insert the hook into the third stitch pull up a loop two and three then yarn over pull through except the last one and pull through chain three for the pico and slip stitch into the loops of the single crochet chain of two yarn over the hook we skip one and puff stitch into the second stitch insert the hook into the second stitch one pull up a loop two and three then yarn over pull through and pull through two loops chain of three and work a slip stitch into two loops of the single crochet then chain of two and so on we have done five puff stitches as we did in the first time and as you can see i did subtuple treble crochet stitch then you should repeat the first segment as many times as you need as you can see this hole now i show you how to remove this hole after we have made subtuple treble crochet stitch we make three make a chain three single crochet one two three then chain three for the pico and slip stitch into the loops of the single crochet and 14 single crochet stitches let's count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen and let's make the last one i don't complete this stitch then insert the hook insert the hook around the stitch and make the second single crochet not finished then yarn over pull through three loops at once so i remove so i remove this hole in this way turn the work chain of five one two three four five yarn over the hook we skip two stitches and puff stitch into the third stitch let's make three strings one two three then pull through except the last one and pull through two loops chain three for the pico and slip stitch into two loops of the single crochet so you should crochet four more puff stitches and make subtuple treble crochet stitch the length of the lace tape you determine by yourself today we have learned how to make white lace tape made in crocheted lace technique this is double-sided lace tape I remind you you can use it as a belt bracelet or a necklace or it can be part of irish project for more charts patterns diagrams please visit our website sharonitin.com as i showed you at the beginning this is the second variation of this lace tape i did double crochet instead of puff stitches and used the variegated yarn 
to create this lace tape. Thanks for watching.